Hello guys, so welcome to KO Tutorials. So let's continue with the next part of this tutorial. So let's get started. So as you can see over here, we have started with the modeling of this coffee stall over here. So let's continue it. So now what I'll be doing over here is like, I'll be taking one more box over here. I'll just, or I'll just hide this selection if required. So I can just go over here and I'll just hide the selection. I'll go into this swift loop over here. I'll select this polygons. Slightly extrude this up over here. So now I can again go over here. I can just place it up and hide. I'll shuffle this up over here. So I'll just duplicate it. So let's just make some copies. So just select this whole thing over here. And now duplicate it the same way we did it over here. So let's just keep on duplicating this again. All right. So once you have duplicated this, just save the file. Again, I'll go over here. I'll again take a box over here. Slightly just shuffle this up. So convert to editable poly. Select the vertices. Slightly push it inside, shuffle it down, save the file. So we have some uh, details over here, so we need to create those details. So I'll just activate this auto grid over here, push this up. So convert to editable poly, I'll go down, so select the vertices, shuffle this a bit up, take a swift loop over here, select the polygons and slightly extrude it by local normal and shuffle it up. So select this slight inset and extrude it down So I'll just scale this over here and I'll push it over here. So these are some of the basic uh, things which you can create like you have or sandwiches or something. Let's just take a box. Or you can just take a line tool also. So let's just take a line tool and shuffle this 
over here scale this so let's go into this and let's give an extrude modifier so again I'll go over here take one more copy convert to editable poly so we'll be just modeling it very basics so we don't need much detail so these are very small elements don't need to model it very high poly unless and until you have a very uh, close-up shot then you can do that so I'll just group this over here I'll just shuffle it up now again I'll go over here copy this in whatever axis you want and we can just keep it in this way mirror it in Z axis let's click OK so push this over here So just duplicate it all right so we can create such stuff again I'll go into this so if you are going with the details you need to create all this stuff again take a copy of it I can slightly scale this a bit can take a cylinder so now I'll just convert to editable poly and I'll take a FFD cylinder so let's go into this press R and slightly I'll just scale it I'll just push it down in this way and convert to editable poly select this polygons so if you are creating cake or something or anything so slightly just insert it let's give a bit of bevel to it so let's put this select this slightly I'll rotate it So I'll just go on to the top again. I'll scale it. Just make it turbo smooth and isolate. So I can just put it over here. Let's give any color to it. So you can just duplicate it. So go over here so you can just press shift and make multiple copies of it as required now 
I'll again just hide this. Again, I'll take one more copy of it. Let's take a box. So increase its height segments and let's give a noise over here. So let's just assign a noise modifier. I'll just assign a noise modifier and let's give a turbo smooth. is also a kind of a sandwich or something it's going to make the file heavier i just can even use proxy if required. I'll just save the file. I'll again unhide this. Hide the selection. And you can just go over here. Select this whole thing. So we can just select this all slightly I can just scale this if required so just select this and scale this let's group this so if you group it that would be much better now so selecting this is very tedious job so let's just group all these elements and hide all So guys if any doubts please put it in the comment section over here. So please like and subscribe my youtube channel. So we will continue the rest of the part in the coming tutorial. So as we are doing some detailing part it's going to take time. So there are a lot of things to be modeled yet over here. So please like and subscribe my youtube channel. So we will continue the rest of the part in the coming tutorial. So thanks for watching this tutorial.